Yes? The new patient is here. They're early. That's fine. We can start now. I'm glad you came. Just turning up shows your commitment to the process. Good. I've read your notes. The other therapist didn't work out for you. I want you to know this will be different. We take this at your pace. No notes. No drugs. No theories. We go back to the start. Understand what happened. Take a look at this short form. I promise it's the only one you'll see during your therapy. Try to answer truthfully. It's easier that way. Never cheated on a partner, really? Okay. Let's get started then. Cheryl! Cheryl? Sweetie? Oh my god. Cheryl? 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 Cheryl! Sweetie.
Teresa. I gotta head off now, so I'm locking up. That woman came in, decided to sell the dress. Walked all the way here on her own. She seemed so sad, I almost didn't want to take it. Oh well. Anyway, I locked up back as well. I stuck the key in Jane's jacket. Take care. You okay, sir? Not a good night to be out and about. I'm looking for my daughter. Take a seat. Your daughter. Go on. We were in a car accident. When I came to, she was gone. Maybe she went to get help. She a clever girl? Sensible? Yeah, I think so. She's seven. Her name's Cheryl. Here's a photo. Cute. Harry Mason. Levin Street. Your ID says you live on Levin Street. That's a few blocks from here. Levin Street, yeah. Yeah, that's where I live. Uh-huh. You feeling okay, Harry? Any headache? Nausea? Blurred vision? A bit of all of them. Maybe she went home. Makes sense. Harry? Your phone? My phone? Right. They hung up. A lot of problems with phones on account of the storm. Maybe that was your little girl. She could be trying to call me from home. Oh, you 
shit. I need to follow this up. It's okay. I'll head home. I'm sure she's there. Tell you what. Soon as I'm done, I'll meet you over there. Levin Street. Thanks. Take care. at the world's most beautiful prom dress. I am so excited. Mike will be putty in my hands. Catch up tonight. Are you at home? <laughs> Sweetie, wait there. Wait for me. You have to run, Daddy. You can't fight them. Run! What? Is somebody with you? Cheryl! I'm coming to get you! Damn it!
It's good that we touched on the car crash. That would have been a breakthrough before. But let's leave that topic for a while. I want to talk about family. It's important to you. For you, family is about physical affection and making your feelings known. You're giving me that look. I'm talking too much. Well, let's have you talk, or not, or whatever you feel comfortable doing. Let's play true or false. Is it true to say you're a private person? Would you say it takes a while for people to get to know you? Uh-huh. People can choose their friends, but not their family. Would you prefer to spend time with friends over family? Nothing surprising there. No. You're going to like this. On the table are some pencils and a picture. I want you to let out your inner child and color in the picture. It's titled Happy. finished. What a lovely family home. Is your home like this? Are you okay, son? No! What are you people doing in my house? Cheryl! Easy there, this isn't your house. Some trouble, honey? No, Lucy, this man here is just a little confused. This is my house! Well, 